<laughs> I felt like I was just in the menu. <laughs> Hello, my beautiful, wonderful, most amazing friends ever. I am so excited on this very early morning because I have the brand new Blend Bunny Cosmetics collaboration with Ellis. Oh my gosh, I saw this collection announced and I was like, <laughs> It is stunning. So we're going to go ahead and dive straight on into it. Well, I have been up since 6 a.m. because I work today and I got this package last night and I was like, oh my God, I don't have time to film because I got home late at work. I got home late from work and I was exhausted and I just, I got this in the mail and I was like, I really want to play with this. So I sacrificed my sleep this morning. I got up super early so we can play with this collection. So Blend Bunny Cosmetics for the first time ever is doing their first ever collaboration and it is with the beautiful Ellis right here. And if you guys are unfamiliar with who this is, Ellis was the very first winner of the show called Glow Up. Now, I personally have never watched the show, but I am familiar with Ellis. And I will say this is a stunning, a stunning photo. On the back, there is a beautiful written note from Ellis right here. I'm not going to read it out loud just in case you guys want to be surprised by it. I'll leave it for you guys. But Ellis and Blend Bunny created a beautiful, beautiful iconic collection. Okay guys, so up first we do have the Ellis. This is the volume one face and eye palette. This palette is way more than a rainbow palette. It captures the essence of a rainbow whilst giving you various undertones. With bold matte formulas that blend like butter and gleaming liquid metal shimmers, the Ellis palette gives you the tools to create without limits. This palette is comprised of 40 high impact mattes, four ethereal veal shimmers, and one liquid metal shimmer. It retails for 66 US dollars. So this is gonna be the palette right here. And I will say I absolutely do love the outside packaging. I think it's so freaking beautiful. It's also massive. This is the biggest Blend Bunny palette. I swear, massive. On the back, you do have Ellis right here. Can we talk about how gorgeous this like custom artwork is? Like what the heck? I would be so thrilled if that were me. I'd be like screaming up and down if that were me. And then you open the palette up on the inside. You do have a huge mirror with Ellis right there along with all of the shades right here. Now I went ahead and I swatched everything and I will say these swatched beautifully, especially the shade right here called the engineer. Oh my God, this like liquid metal, absolutely stunning. Now I did see so many people in the comment section saying that, oh no, this is just another rainbow palette or this is just like the blends palette and the surge palette mixed together. I can see what they're talking about. But I really do love the fact that there's just so many different varying undertones in this palette. It's kind of like the best of both mixed into one. And I know a lot of people also saw this and they compared it to the Carnival palette by BP by Be Perfect Cosmetics. Now I actually do own the Carnival palettes because I think they're gorgeous. So like I have the Love Tahiti one right here. This is the volume three. And to me, looks completely different in my opinion. And I know I think the biggest one that people probably are comparing it to is the Carnival Interstellar palette right here. This is probably the biggest one that people are comparing it to. So I'm just gonna show them kind of side by side. So this is the Carnival one right here. So this is gonna be like a rainbow slash like space theme palette, right? Very gorgeous, love this palette. But then when you actually look at the Ellis palette, it's just different. They have similarities, but they're different. They're so different. Palace palette has more pinky and green tones where this palette really kind of gives you the rainbow. So I just wanted to show like a quick comparison because I know a lot of people online are saying that, you know, they're the same they're not the same. So I just kind of wanted to show the two together because I know some people were saying that they were the same online. I'm like, mm, they're very much, very different. The Ellis palette just has way more tones that you can choose through and different undertones, which I think is great. And I just love the fact that the shimmers in here just really help to elevate the palette, not to mention the different undertones. Like there are different undertones for all the shades. Like this is probably going to be one of the perfect like rainbow palettes you can probably find because there's so many different tones in here and different shades, which I think is incredible. Can't believe you guys let me talk to you guys with these dry ass crusty lips. I literally got up at 6 a.m. to get this show rolling because I have to work today and I did not want to miss out on an upload because I, I love Blend Bunny. You guys know that Blend Bunny is in like my top three favorite brands. I absolutely live for Blend Bunny Cosmetics. So when I saw the package got delivered last night, I was like, no, I was so excited, but I was like, I'm at work and I can't do anything about it. Okay, so I'm just going in with my Pete Louise base right here so we can kind of lay down just a simple base. And I'm gonna do two different eye looks. Now I will say, I love how this palette is laid out. Like it is laid out very, very user-friendly. So like on this side, you are gonna have your bright like reds, 
yellows, oranges, blacks, and pinks. On the side, you're gonna have your greens and your blues, your purples, and your more neutral shades. I love it. It's split down the middle by those shimmer shades right here. It's just very user-friendly, and it kind of makes it easy, too. If you want to do an eye look, you can kind of just go straight down this way to do an eye look. On every single like like row, you can kind of just go straight down, which I'm actually something I'm actually gonna do because I think it's really nice. Or if you wanna do something, you can go straight across straight across and what i also love about the fact is that these shimmers right here complement the shades that they're next to so like these this little supernova shade is going to have like a yellow green shift to it it complements that entire row and then the blue shades and everything around it i think it's amazing how well they placed it because it really does complement the surrounding shades the surrounding rows i think it's freaking incredible that they did that i love that little touch like that little touch i'm just like that chef kiss to me. <laughs> so we're actually gonna go into the shade called Supernova, that first little shimmer shade right here. Cause I'm gonna do two different eye looks. I'm gonna do one eye look based upon this side, one eye look based upon this side, just cause I feel like it'd be kind of cool to try to touch as much colors as I can. You guys know that I absolutely live and breathe for Blend Bunny Cosmetics. I have been the biggest fan since Maggie had, well, before Maggie even created Blend Bunny, I like Blend Bunny Cosmetics, I was only such a ma major fan of her work and just to see her expanding and evolving and creating more and more products and collaborating with other content and collaborating with creators out there just shows me like how much she's like grown as her business and it just makes me so happy for her because I just, if Maggie is just, she's so sweet, she's so talented and I just love seeing her brand thrive and just flourish and I'm just, ah, I'm so excited for her. Okay, I'm gonna go into the shade right here called Specimen, this little green shade. I'm actually gonna go down this row for the first look because I feel like this would be such a really pretty look. I feel like these shades really complement each other. And they also come in the iconic Blend Bunny formula that we all know and love. So I'm gonna go ahead and just stamp this shade in right here, very softly. Now this is gonna be more of a bright neon and anything bright neon or bright pastel normally doesn't always have as long longevity for me or I have to really kind of pack it in or I have to put down a color base underneath it to really help to make it pop but this right here is laying down rather nicely. Now it's gonna be messy. We're gonna trust the process. We're gonna go into the shade called Cosmic right here. I will say there's definitely quite a bit of kick up in the pan, but that's okay. Very, oh my God, just dropped my palette. Ah, oh, it survived, she survived. Okay, now we're gonna tap that shade called Cosmic right in. Oh my God, I thought I broke this because it fell completely open. Then we're gonna go into Ather right here. That's a gorgeous shade. And then I'm gonna finish it with the shade called Illusion right here. And then we're gonna start to work on blending these shades together. I am so excited for Ellis. I know what it's like to get to collaborate with a brand, but like just to have a brand allow you to just be so creative and just let you kind of have free range to create and make whatever you want. Like I know that this is probably just like a dream come true and I would love like anything in the world. I would absolutely love to collaborate with Blend Money one day because I freaking love this brand and their formula is just my God, so good. So I'm so beyond excited for Ellis because I know this is such a moment to see something that you have worked on so hard and so long come true. I hope Ellis is very proud because I am very proud of Ellis. So I'm gonna worry about fixing this still in just a minute. I just kinda wanted to lay everything down before I continue to kinda work on it, build it up, blend it out just a little bit more, but I think it looks really pretty. And I kinda just already softly diffuse it and it's already slowly kinda just blending in together very, very, very nicely. So now we're gonna go into this side. I really wanna play with like the yellows, oranges, reds, and like maroons. We're gonna do something kinda similar. So I'm gonna take the shade right here called Engineer because I just really want to play with this shade. It is just literally like liquid molten. Like, oh, say less. So gorgeous. I just want to see how well that looks. Oh, my God. That's so pretty. That is so pretty. And I just realized I did that typical like influencer thing that people go, oh, my God, I just did that. I'm so sorry. I just think that this is such a gorgeous, like gorgeous just shimmer. I mean, just, oh, I could just literally wear that by itself. I go into the shade called magnetic i'm gonna kind of like be mixing this yellow shade with kind of like these three right here so i'm just gonna kind of be mixing them all so you're just gonna kind of just see me kind of tapping in because i really want to play around with these yellows i know yellows are very difficult to formulate because i remember i struggled to get the perfect yellow that i wanted for my palette and i just know that yellows can be a little tricky but oh my god when they work they're 
beautiful. I'm gonna go into the shade called Nuclear right here. Speaking of nuclear, I've been watching this show called Fallout on Amazon and on Amazon I know it's based upon the game, but it's a one game I actually have not played. Oh my god, it is so good. It's like the 1960s me like 2100. It's so freaking good. If you guys have not seen it, I highly recommend checking out Fallout on Amazon. I really, really, really love it. Remember, I will worry about blending and putting everything together when I'm done. I just really want to lay down the color. We're going to go into Perception right here. I just really want to lay down the colors before I focus on blending out everything. Because this is when I'm going to kind of go into the other undertones and kind of mix things together how I want. See, this is why I love the fact there's different undertones because it makes it really easy to kind of mix and match. And lastly, I'm going to place the shade called Divine Divine right here. Oh, that's a really, really, really gorgeous shade. Now that that's all laid down, now I'm going to focus on blending out everything. I'm going to come back with my majority of my face done we're gonna do the under eyes together the blushes together and the highlight together so i'll be right back now that we have the eyes on face on we're gonna go ahead and go into the two blush palettes right here so these are the solar flare and lunar eclipse dimension palette these blush trio harness multiple tones of pink and orange helping you achieve ellis's signature sculpted cheek Ellis believes that contour doesn't stop at the contour powder and that the blush is the key to the dimensional finish. These do retail for $26 each. I do have both palettes right here. We have the Solar Flare Dimensional Palette, which just is so freaking beautiful. I love a good like orange blush. I don't know what it is. I think it's so freaking gorgeous. And then we also have the Lunar Eclipse Dimension Palette right here, which is going to be a beautiful pinky vibe palette. So I'm going to actually use both today because I just feel like both deserve to have their own moment. So we're actually going to use both today. So on this cheek, let's go ahead and go into the pink one. And on this one, we're going to go more into the orange one. So I'm actually going to take the shade called Crescent and the shade called Zero. And I'm actually going to kind of mix the two together, just to lightly tap in. And we're going to just start to stamp it right here on the cheek. Ooh, that is very, very, very soft. Okay. Oh, that's like a baby pink. That's really pretty. I wonder if I could add a little bit of Eclipse. Just a tiny, like tiny, 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 tiny pop right there. Because I don't want to do too much. Wow. That is so pretty. I like the mix of all three. I feel like it really helps to just kind of create a unique color. I really like that. Now to move on to the Solar Flare one, I live for a good orange blush. So I really want to take the shade called Heat. I'm going to tap into Flare very so, like ever so slightly. Take this and boop. Now there's something about that orange blush. That I feel like during the summer season, it just, I don't know. I just feel like it's so pretty. I just freaking love a good orange blush because I feel like it's just great to give me like a nice bronzy like contour look without actually being like super bronzy and i just feel like it just works so well i'm taking a little bit of the shade called flare right here just to add on top to add just a little bit more peachy tone to it i'm just gonna start to just blend that out so gorgeous <laughs> i really live for that okay so lastly i do have the celestial cheek glaze right here this high intensity cheek glaze delivers an instant flush of pink radiance with the formula that applies like a powder and gives you the appearance of a glimmering star this actually does retail for 16 dollars. i love 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 the outside packaging it's so gorgeous and then you look at this on the inside i'm like holy crap that is beautiful it's a little intense it's a little intense i'm not gonna lie I don't know how often I would get a use out of like a cheek glaze like this because it's very intense, but we're gonna go for it today. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this. I'm gonna start to just lay this right here. Ooh. You know what's really nice is that it does have like a multi-dimensional finish to it. Like I can see purple and orange in the reflex of the pink like celestial. I can see purple and orange reflex in this, which I think is absolutely just stunning. Look how nicely that mixes with that blush. I wonder if it's going to pull more orange on this side. Oh my God, look, it actually does. You guys see that? 
So because I laid it upon the uh, Solar Flare palette, it actually lays a little bit more orange. You can see the orange shift coming through, but on this side, you guys can see that pink shift coming through. Do you guys see that? That is really cool. It's like a really multi-dimensional cheek glaze or like a highlighter. It's very gorgeous and it's just blending with whatever shade it's laying on top of. I absolutely love that. So to finish off the face, we're gonna go back into this palette. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna recreate what I did on this eye with deeper shades. So I'm just gonna go in with like the deeper shades right here to slowly blend out underneath. I'm gonna do the same thing on this eye, just kind of utilizing this palette as best as I can. So I'm just gonna quickly do that and then I'm gonna throw on some liner in my lips and then I will be right on back to give you guys my thoughts on the new on the new Blend Bunny Cosmetics collaboration with Alice. Alrighty guys, this is the final look right here. First off, I'm living for like this rainbow look. I think it's so pretty. I have not done a colorful look in a hot minute and I'm like just living for it. I'm also just really living for like my cheeks right now like they are just like sparking so much joy in me like this side right here oh my god i'm living for it okay so i'm gonna quickly run down on this collection so this collection is going to be launching this sunday april 21st at 10 a.m pacific standard time which will be 1 p.m eastern standard time you guys can use code alley which will save you guys 10 percent off your collection and i'm just I'm so freaking excited about it. So I'm just gonna quickly run down the list. We have the Ellis palette right here. This does retail for $66. You get 40 shades for $66. Like that is absolutely incredible. 40 shades for $66. I think this is definitely a steal. The price point is just phenomenal for how many shades you're actually gonna get in this palette. Yes, you get majority mattes, but the shimmers that are in here are just gorgeous. I did take the shade called Ethereal and I put that in the inner corner on both eyes. And I also put the shade called Transcend right here. And then I went in with this entire row to do my underneath. And then I kind of mixed and matched different shades in here to do the underneath on this one. And I just have to say the palette just speaks for itself. Maggie's formula when it comes to her mattes are just out of this world. They're so easy to work with. They're so easy to blend. I absolutely love Blend Bunny Cosmetics formula. The shimmers are gorgeous. And I think Ellis did a really beautiful job creating so many different tones for like a beautiful rainbow palette. Like you have so many different tones that you can work with. Like this is like the blends palette like on steroids just so much bigger and <laughs> so much bigger so many tones to work with and I think that both Ellis and Maggie created something really beautiful right here so if you never had the blends palette if you never had the surge palette if you never had any like the be perfect palettes this is going to be the one for you I'm telling you this is beautiful this would be the, probably the only rainbow palette you ever need and I'm just so happy that I have it and it's just a beautiful palette overall same thing with the cheek palettes these are multi-dimensional as well you can use these as eyeshadows if you want to you can use them as like paint if you want to you can use them however you want but you do have two different versions right here they do retail for $26 a piece they are the solar flare and they are the lunar eclipse and I think these are so beautiful it's hard for me to tell you guys which one to get if I had to pick one because I just think they're both really beautiful I really loved the lunar eclipse how I kind of mixed all three shades to get the shade that I have right here but then I also really am just living for like this like orange peachy moment on this side that I just think is so gorgeous. Like I'm literally going to be wearing this shade to work today. I do have to take off my makeup because it's a little bit too intense for Disney, but I am gonna be recreating this right here for work. This is a absolutely weird doing this because I just, I think, I think I'm living for this side just a bit more because I just, I love a good orange blush or something about an orange blush and I'm just like absolutely living for it. And like these two combined, oh, so freaking pretty. And I did not play with Scorch. That's a little bit too deep for me, but I'm sure I can make it work very, very lightly. But I just, I think these are gorgeous. The formula is incredible. And then lastly, we have the Celestial Cheek Guilt Lace right here. Now this retails for 16 and I was a little unsure about it at first. I was like, oh, I don't know if this is gonna work because when I swatched it, I was like, this is a little bit too pinky. How am I gonna make this work for me? But for some reason, the way that it just takes on the shade that you lay it on top of is just gorgeous. Like it has like a really beautiful pinky highlight tone to this, but when I turn it to the side, it pulls more orange. Like it pulls like more like an orange highlight, which I really love. It's that multi-dimensional that's in here. Cause I told you I saw purple, orange, and like pink, and it's really just helping to take on the shape. It's really helping to take on the color that it's laying on. And I just think it just melts very beautifully into the skin. It's very gorgeous. You can use this as an eyeshadow topper, an inner corner highlight, brow highlight. You can use this as a face highlight. You can use this however you want. You could tap it on your lips. It is multidimensional and I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I don't have with this collection is the Starburst Lash Clusters. These are individual clusters that add drama and dimension to every eye look. Stack them, layer them, wear them how you want. 
for that personalized touch they retail for $12 I'm actually personally okay that I don't have them I've never ever ever worked with individual lashes before so that would be a first for me I kind of would have no clue what to do <laughs> I would have no clue what to do so I'm kind of okay that I did not get that but if you guys do want to get it it does retail for $12 so overall i think this collection is very exciting i love a very colorful palette i love the cheek moments i love that cheek glaze i think it's beautiful i think ellis and maggie created something really fun really exciting and i'm just i'm so happy for them both so i'll make sure i list all the details down below but blend bunny cosmetics thank you so much for sending this to me ellis congratulations on this beautiful launch and i'm just i'm so excited for you guys so that my beautiful friends is it for today's video guys if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure you guys give this video a cheeky thumbs up don't forget to subscribe my channel if you guys have not already it's three to four videos every single week make sure you guys head over to my other channels are for life you guys get to see my cool wonderful adventures my amazing husband Corey. and as always the biggest thank you goes to these beautiful wonderful page members you guys see right here thank you guys so much for everything and to my subscribers and viewers thank you guys so much for being here whether you guys like this video you guys thumbs down this video you guys subscribe to guys did not subscribe either way thank you guys so much for being here i love and appreciate each and every single one of you so with that said guys i love you and i'll see you guys in the very next video